Yo guys, what's up? It's another beautiful morning out here at uh, in the Arts District. We're about to go to Makers of Finders right now. It's like down the street. We're shooting some some coffee stuff. Josh kind of gave me a list of things to do right now, and I'm gonna be there for about maybe an hour, an hour and a half at most, and then I gotta hightail it over to uh, Chinatown, the roastery, it's called Take It Easy, July 15th. The one thing that I'm trying, that I've been like thinking about, I, I feel like there's only so many ways that you can shoot coffee and food and all this stuff, and one of the things that I'm realizing is that, oh shit, I'm, so, I'm about to shoot the cold brew right now because there's a certain shot that I, I kinda wanna get, and, I'm I'm thinking about it, I'm like, man, I gotta try to shoot the exact same thing constantly over and over and over and over and over again. So now it's up to me to find like all this inspiration to find all these different ways of shooting the exact same thing. You know, I'm using Pinterest, I'm going on different um different Instagram accounts. I don't know what else to say about that. That's that's what I need to do. And that's my goal. So I have, I have some cool shots in mind here. You'll, you're about to see the behind the scenes. Of, oh, you know what? I should have brought the apron. Sorry, I lost my train of thought. So I'm going here right now, and man, I hate this mess, bro. We're about to shoot some uh, some coffee stuff. We have some products that we have to shoot. The merch. Uh, we just got new growlers and tumblers. Tumblers. I had to ask him. I was like, the f what? What's a tumbler? <laughs> and then we gotta shoot some hats. Which, by the way. It's gonna be really soon, and I gotta find a way to shoot it. So maybe, maybe I'll sport it like this. Maybe I'll just, you see, look, I'm, I'm already coming up with ideas. Woohoo! I have the tumblers and the growlers right now, and so I'm just gonna like set up to. Uh, you got them already? Huh? You got them already? Yeah, I have them right now. I'll show you. Let's see. <laughs> Does he really? <laughs> Oh, I don't know. He has like all of them, and I'm like, how do you get them? When does this happen? <laughs> so oh, this is so cute. I wish it was like the round ones, the wine ones. You know, this is like so square. <laughs> but it's cute. It's so nice, though. I like it. it. It's nice. You know what? And then we also got liquid magic. Oh, Did I pull that side off. Boom. We got with what's called a tumbler. So my idea for the shot is to um, get cold brew. And when, I'm gonna set this, this camera up on a tripod and I'm going to like, just pour cold brew into it. Mm -hmm. So it's kind of like this. So I might hold it, or I'm gonna hold it like this. Show the, I'll show both sides, like both logos. And then it's just gonna drop cold brew in there. I'm just gonna pour a ton of cold brew inside of it. That's that's my idea. Like, you want to keep it. That's why you want to put. Well, no, because he that's he wants me to like shoot it, and I'm just like, look, <laughs> you have to let me do my magic. He's like, okay, cool. So that's my plan right now. Why don't you just put coffee on this one and put something else on that one? What like, should I put in here? I don't know, hibiscus tea or something like that. Oh, that's interesting. Well, what are people carrying tumblers? Water. <laughs> <laughs> Water. Okay. <Yeah. laughs> That might be a better idea, except Lemonade. just branding wise, I feel like <laughs> cold brew is gonna be like the better no, way no, to go. That's what I'm saying. This one's more like for like hot things, right? So you should do that, and then usually people use that for keeping okay. it cold. So that one, hibiscus right? tea. No, yeah. No. Cold brew. Or you wanna do the cold brew in there? I said that was for hot things. Yeah. Cold brew. Oh, but it's, it's cold, brew. cold brew. What the fuck is that? <laughs> uh, uh, coffee. Uh. Oh, just like normal, like house coffee. Yeah, yeah. Oh, and it like steams yeah, and shit. That's why oh, I that's interesting. So cool. I hope. Hmm. I might. I might put that in Photoshop because I ain't trying to burn myself. But that's not a bad idea, though. Mm -hmm. I might. I might do that. I lost Tiff right now. Um, yeah. I guess. That's it. I'll. Um, I'm gonna do these real quick, I and then. <laughs> I was thinking coffee, and I'm like. That's why I was like, you're like this. Bro. This for. Bro, it's too early for this. <laughs> <laughs> Okay. Oh, yeah. All right. I'm gonna go shoot this stuff. All right. So, I have to find a way to shoot this cold brew and this tumbler. It's pretty cool. I like it a lot. I might ask Josh if I can keep it. We gotta shoot this. My idea is to shoot it like this, maybe like this, but I want it in like not in the shade, more of like right here in the brightness. Might zoom that into a 70, and then the the, the plan is to pour this and just 
port into here, but you're not gonna see the cup and frame. You're just gonna see the tumbler and frame, and you just see coffee dropping on into it. That's kind of my plan, my goal. Usually people would carry water in this, but for brand's sake, I'm gonna go ahead and put cold brew in here. I think that's just a good thing to do. I get to it first, I got you mad. I guess that when I get to it last. Get it that I'm never going back. Get it that I'm never going back. I get to it first, I got you mad. I guess that when I get to it last. Get it that I'm never going back. Get it that I'm never going back. Going up, going up, going up, going up. All right, this is the fun part. This is what's called a growler. This is where you put hot stuff in here. Pretty dope. We're gonna do the same thing with the as the cold brew, we're gonna put hot coffee in it. That's not gonna be fun, but I'm hoping I get steam from it. I knew this would happen someday. You can ask my day one day. Cloudy days turn the sun rays. Imagine. Just see it drizzle down. See, this is the type of stuff that I gotta shoot over and over and over again. And there are infinite ways to do this, to shoot it, you know, you can do so many actions, you can do so many stills, you can do so many locations, there's so many ways to do it. So if, like, I feel like once I like start shooting the same thing over and over again, I'm gonna get lost in the sauce and be like, how do I do this? Like, I'm gonna lose my train of thought, and that's why I'm just gonna keep watching creators and keep watching people and see how they do it. I've been trying to look at how people do it. No one else seems to be doing it. Like, I don't, I'm not seeing enough of it. Maybe I'm not looking hard enough, but I'm still doing the research, still doing the thing, but again, how many times can you shoot the same thing over and over again? Which is why I always try to go the extra mile on every single shot. It makes it just a little bit more unique. Good. Just got done with the shoot, shot some extra stuff, and um, gonna eat some breakfast, drink my coffee, and we're gonna go over to the Chinatown location and shoot some more stuff over there. Get it that I'm never going Never going Ooh. Right All right, tight. So we're not doing the, the shoot over at Chinatown today. We're doing all the food that is gonna be available at Chinatown. We're doing that tomorrow morning. They're getting their head start at 6 a.m. I don't really need to be there until 7.30 to kind of like plan it out, but I'm gonna plan it out a little bit more later today. So like, same thing, you know, like, there's only, okay, maybe, you know what, that's wrong. There's not only one way to shoot stuff, there, there's a million ways to do it. And the one thing I'm trying to get across in this video is that it's going to be very difficult to do that at some point in time. So. I'm trying to like look up videos on like how to, you know, the many different ways of shooting stuff. So what's fun about this job right now is that I'm not really costly. I'm not just like one type of photographer, videographer. I have to be a food photographer. I have to be a product photographer. I have to be a, um, a, a portrait photographer and, and a product photographer and like, and then like a landscape photographer. There's, there's so many, there's so many different types of photography that you know I, I get to do so it's it, it won't be the most difficult thing but at some point it, it is a coffee shop and they one of the things that gets really good engagement is you know food and coffee like coffee especially so so my goal and I was told that <laughs> on on the food stuff I need to tone it down a little bit like I don't need to be so artsy with it it's more for like Oh wait, I don't think I'm supposed to tell you guys that. I'll bleep it out. But yeah, I'm gonna continue to push these boundaries and I'm gonna continue to keep doing my thing until someone tells me, hey, maybe do it this way, hey, maybe do it that way. Hopefully, you know, that'll that'll help me out just a little bit. I think I know what I'm doing right now and everyone seems to love the photos, uh, all the different styles and all the different, they love it. The, the first round of stuff, they loved it. Now, we just need to 
constantly adjust, 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 adjust. That's it, adjusting, adapting, all that good stuff. That's really all this job is gonna be, you know, it's gonna be like this for the first like month or two, just continuously adjusting to each other and syncing up with each other. You know, um, Josh and I, we're, we're trying to make, we're trying to like, we're just trying to get our visions across to each other and we're just gonna keep talking about it and keep doing it until we are fully, fully in sync. But yeah, that's it, that's the vlog. Just wanted to show you guys um, a, one of my days that's, uh, you know, that's over there. That, that was definitely one of the funner shoots right there. I always love just pouring the, you know, coffee in there. And I'm taking my time on this, too. The reason why the other photos were so good is because I actually took my time. I actually gave it a second. I actually gave it some thought. I pre-planned it, and I was making sure everything was as close to perfect as possible. You know, put on my glasses here. But yeah, guys, you know what? That's it. That's where I'm going to leave it off. Um, if you got something out of this, let me know in the comments below. If you guys want to see certain things that I do with Makers and Finders and Take It Easy, uh, let me know. If you guys have any suggestions on what I should do with them, that would be greatly appreciated too. Definitely helps me out. I love the criticism. I'll take it. You know, I'm still a beginner at this as well. Um, this is very new for me. So anything you guys can provide, that would be solid. Appreciate you guys watching. I'll catch you guys later. Stay fire, flame, fuego. Well, I don't know. <laughs> I was gonna like roll the glasses into here. Also, last thing. So I know I'm working for Makers and Finders. Um, I'm also on the freelance game right now. The one thing I'm trying to, um, not trying to, I think I've got it down. If you are a Las Vegas based like artist or wherever, wherever you happen to be, you know, if you're in Las Vegas, that's a lot better. If you're like an artist, a rapper, a singer, um, and you have cover photos and you, and you have, and you need cover photos and you want a cool composition, something like this right here. See that, that right there, I think would look great for people who are just trying to show off their work a little bit more, put their music music in the background, really, really curate it for them. That was a perfect example for someone who has like a country rock and roll album type thing. So yeah, if you're into that stuff, that looks like something that you need. Artists, hit me up. Businesses as well, it really, it works pretty awesome with like food and drinks and stuff like that. I've gotten that down. Um, I'm gonna be doing it for makers. You guys will be seeing that really soon. And yeah, if you guys need stuff, hit me up in the DMs, in the comments. For right now, hit me up on Instagram. Hit me up in the DMs. Let me know what you guys want, and I will get back to you as soon as I can. We can talk about you know all the nitty gritty details. All right, all right, cool. I'll catch you guys later. Bye, bye. Sorry, selfless um promotion. Bye.